Good morning dear students. Today we will solve sums based on calendar. Let's start. Raman and Gagan were coming back to home from school. On the way they were talking with each other. Raman said to Gagan that my birthday is there on 25th November. Gagan said which day is there on 25th November? Then Raman said, Now I have learnt how to read calendar. There is a calendar in my home. Let's go to my home and we will see there that which day is there on 25th November. Here we have a calendar of November 2020 and there are 30 days in the month of November and on one side of calendar days of week are written and my birthday is there on 25th November. Let's see which day is there. Yes, on 25th November the day is Wednesday means my birthday is there on Wednesday. Raman, do you know the birth anniversary of Shri Guru Nanak Dev Ji is also there in November. Oh wow, it is on which date? It is on 30th November. Now let's see which day is there on 30th November. It is Monday means this year the birth anniversary of Shri Guru Nanak Dev Ji is on 30th November Monday. Now let's solve some more questions based on calendar. Like our first question is how many Sundays were there in January 2016 and in January 2018. Dear students, here we have a calendar of 2016 in which months are written from January to December and in every month's calendar days of week are written and under the names of days of week, dates are written like on 1 January 2016, the day was Friday. Dear students, here we have a calendar of January 2016. Now let's count number of Sundays in January 2016. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. There were 5 Sundays in January 2016. 16. Dear students, here we have a calendar of January 2018. Now let's count its Sundays. 1, 2, 3, 4. There were 4 Sundays in January 2018. So dear students, here we have seen there were 5 Sundays in January 2016 and 4 Sundays in January 2018. Now, our second question is, on which day did the Independence Day fall in year 2018? Dear students, when do we celebrate Independence Day? Yes, we celebrate Independence Day on 15 August. And to find that day on Independence Day in year 2018, we will see the calendar of August 2018. Dear students, here we have a calendar of August 2018. Now let's see which day was there on 15 August 2018. And on 15 August 2018, the day was Wednesday. Now our next question is, what was the date on first Monday in April 2018? So here we will see the calendar of April 2018. And in April 2018, on 1 April the day was Sunday and on 2 April the day was Monday. Means first Monday in April 2018 was on 2 April. Now our next question is what was the date on last Friday of year 2018? 18. Dear students, which is the last month of the year? Yes, it is December. And to find the date 
on last friday of year 2018 we will see the calendar of december 2018 students in the month of december the first friday was on 7 december second friday was on 14 december third friday was on 21 december and last friday was on 28 december means the date on last friday of the year was 28 december so dear students today we have learned to solve some based on calendar now it's time for today's question our today's question is on which day did the republic day fall in year 2018 and for the answer of this question we have four option option a is monday option b is thursday option c is friday and option d is saturday dear students when do we celebrate republic day yes it is on 26 january so to find the day of republic day in year 2018 we will see the calendar of January two thousand eighteen. Dear students, here we can see that on twenty sixth January two thousand eighteen, the day was Friday, which is our C option. So we will tick this option. Now it is time for homework, and from home you will solve exercise six point five in your notebooks. Thank you.